A very unusual time right now, and all of it's because of the coronavirus. Many of us have never experienced anything like this before. So what do we tell our kids? Our lifestyle host, Melissa Paul, helps us answer that question. COVID-19 has really caused a lot of disruption for our daily lives, and that can create a lot of anxiety, not only for adults, but in particular our children. So I decided to reach out to CEO of Idaho Youth Ranch, Scott Curtis, to get more clarity on how we as parents can best communicate about the coronavirus to our kids. How do we as parents help our kids through the instability right now of the coronavirus? I think the big challenge is communicating to them to help them understand the situation, but also not really provoke too much fear. What advice do you have in that regard? What we don't want to do is have the parents express their worry to the kids. When they're communicating with the kids, they need to focus on the fact that they're here um, to share the important information with the kids. And uh, more importantly than anything is to validate the, the kids and their feelings um, and their sense of safety. So, so, so really try to kind of uh, pay attention to those those visual and nonverbal cues and, and just really make sure that we're listening to our kids because like you said, they're going to let us know what they really need from us. That's exactly right. Their nonverbal cues are gonna tell us a lot. There's a lot of a disruption to explain. So the social distancing, uh, the, the real heightened awareness and focusing on hand washing. Um, how do we help our children understand the importance of those things without creating a phobia. Well, the first thing I, I think parents need to do is model calmness and role model what they want the kids doing. So it's, oh man, it's kind of a pain to have to wash our hands this much, but let's go do it and let's do it together and let's, let's sing the happy birthday song. But then when they complain or talk about it, part of that goes to the explaining, hey, we kind of need to do this more right now um, because of these things going on. Um, but it's not a, hey, this is the way of life now forever. I think kind is a big word that we all need to really gravitate towards right now. With all the stress, it's very easy to kind of uh, let go of that word for a little bit because I think it's easy to kind of isolate, but to realize that our actions are impacting everyone around us, which is so important, and to just be kind. At youthranch.org, we've got links to other resources that help parents. Um, we've even got a little piece on there about making this your family's best hour. Scott, thank you so much. I greatly appreciate you taking the time to talk with me, especially given how we are all uh, so busy and there's so much for us to handle at the moment. This, this advice has been very important and I know greatly needed. It's really my privilege. It's our, it's our privilege here to be working with youth and families and um, thank you all for trying to get this information to families when they need it. Absolutely.